We are going to turn to our GMA cover story at last night's vice presidential debate. Mike Pence's wife, Karen Pence, and Kamala Harris's husband, Doug Emhoff, were both showing their support, of course. Rachel Scott is in Salt Lake City with more on the second lady and the man who could be the country's first ever second gentleman. Good morning, Rachel. Michael, good morning. This is a family affair. Whether it's by their side on debate night or out on the campaign trail, these two have become their spouse's top surrogates. Doug Emhoff and Karen Pence embracing their spouses at the end of Wednesday's vice presidential debate. The two may be on opposing sides, but sharing a common goal to help their other halves win the election. And they're hitting the trail hard. Karen Pence has been by her husband's side through runs for Congress and governor of Indiana. The mother of three spent 25 years as an elementary school teacher, an award-winning watercolor artist. She advocates for mental health art therapy and relief for military families. Her son Michael is a Marine pilot and son-in-law in the Navy. It is imperative that we support our military spouses. Over the past year, Karen Pence has been wading further into one of the most contentious campaign seasons in modern history unveiling a new Twitter account with a direct-to-camera appeal to voters. Now is not the time to stop the momentum. We are just getting started. Trading in her business casual look for sleek pantsuits and streamlined skirts. She was center stage at this year's Republican National Convention. 100 years ago, women secured the right to vote. So let's vote, America. She's going to fight for you. And she's going to fight for you day in and day out. And while his wife's candidacy has already made history, Doug Emhoff could be making a little history himself as the first second gentleman. Telling Marie Claire in a recent profile, there's a former role of the VP spouse. I think that's all working, and that's not something I'd be trying to upend. As far as using the platform this position would afford him, he envisions approaching it like I do anything and plans to talk about fairness and talk about justice and talk about equality. Just try to lead by example. Referring to himself as her hubby in his Twitter bio, Emhoff has emerged as the ultimate Harris hype man. Taking a leave of absence from his law firm, his days are devoted to making sure the Biden-Harris ticket goes all the way to the White House. Recently campaigning in key swing states like Florida, Ohio, and Texas. We want to show this country and we want to show the world enough is enough. And their spouses and the candidates are wasting no time getting back out on the campaign trail. Both will be heading out west today. Second Lady Karen Pence joining her husband, the vice president, visiting Arizona as Doug Emhoff hits the key state of Nevada. Robin? Hey, thank you for that insight, Rachel. Really do appreciate that. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.